Eating with Chef Lucy. Welcome back, everyone. I'm Chef Boyer V with Chef Lucy. And if you're hungry, then watch and see what we're making, and you're going to love this one. <laughs> <laughs> it's cacao fudge, guys. Yeah, <laughs> but we're going to make it the healthy way, so yes. that way when you eat it, you can... Just eat it and yeah. don't be thinking about the calories of the sugar. Yes. <laughs> okay. So in today's recipe, instead of the sugar, we're going to be using dates. Okay. So we have a uh, soaking a uh, good amount of uh, dates over here, like a cup and a cup of water. And then you have to soak it up for at least uh, 20 minutes so they get really soft when you blend. Okay. We're going to be using uh, coconut milk, the thick one. Okay. So you can have the consistency for the fudge. Chocolate, I'm using dark chocolate. Oh, see, you can already see the steam, the steam coming out for the double boiler over here. So we're going to add the chocolate already so we can continue to start because it's going to take a little bit of time. Oh, it's already melted. But yeah. I can give you yes. this and you can steer. <laughs> yeah. And then for decoration, we can use some uh, coconut, some co um, uh, pieces I toasted already. Also, we're going to use some cocoa powder for the recipe and the cocoa nibs over here. So I'm going to show you. We just uh, kind of break the cocoa. the cocoa. And then this is the cocoa seeds over here already toasted. Okay. So we're trying to use natural ingredients so we can have the, the full benefits of it, of the chocolate. And of course, it's not the sugar, right. but it's going to taste amazing because we're going to have the sweetness from the, the dates. dates. And we have a lot of dates around so let's take advantage of that yes. okay so all right so we're gonna start by melting the chocolate you're doing a great job oh, and you. i'm gonna continue with the recipe which is gonna be blending the oh, the dates the water in there making sure that they're really soft and also the coconut milk okay it's gonna take just a few minutes really easy recipe and you can have you know the chocolate fudge for snack in the morning or after the gym oh, when yeah. you need something yes. sweet but not too sweet encouragement <laughs> so we have that will be you have something ready ready to eat okay so then yeah. it's ready we have the water the dates the coconut already chocolate Got is it. going Woo! doing an amazing job thank you all right you're higher. I find, I'm, <laughs> I find myself in the kitchen sometimes. <laughs> yeah, so we're going to turn this down a little bit. We're going to make sure that we don't burn the chocolate, otherwise we're going to taste it and it's going to... Not good. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. <laughs> now that we made the blender work, I'm going to make sure that we have blended everything together and make like a smooth paste that we're going to mix with the chocolate, okay? Ooh, okay. All right, so we have that in there. And I think I see a spatula yes, you do. In there. Yeah. So we might make sure. Just keep mixing and just blend. I mean, you can already smell the chocolate and the yes. dates and the coconut. Chocolate I mean, if you're not right. a big fan of the coconut milk, it's okay because it doesn't taste too much of the coconut. <laughs> <laughs> Unless you're allergic to it. And it's February still, so you still have time to make this for your loved one. You know, love, love, love is in the air. air. <laughs> <laughs> no, all month. And nothing say more love than a, like a piece of chocolate. Oh, yeah. Okay. Especially if you make it. <laughs> yeah. Brownie points. <laughs> okay, so we're going to add the coconut over here. And like I said, you can add like any like almonds or walnuts just for consistency and the way is they look, okay? So once we, everything is mixed, we're done. We're just going right. to transfer like a little, I mean, containers. You can have like the cute ones. Like the heart ones. The, yeah, the heart yeah. ones. You can just do whatever you want in there or just like a cheap pan okay. with the liner. Like the flat one? Yeah. The square? Uh-huh. So you can just uh, use that, put in the fridge for like about... I'm just going to omit that because it's going to be really hot. Yeah. <laughs> so make sure that you yeah, don't burn do yourself. Yeah, I have a little scooper. spoon over here. That's going to be uh, there, we there. Go. See, we're just going to transfer to the fridge and we're going to keep them for at least 30 minutes, making sure that they get hard. And then you're going to have the final result in here. Let's just make the round Look ones. How cute. That you can make like any shape you want. <laughs> oh. See? That's messy. Chocolate everywhere. It is chocolate everywhere. <laughs> so this is what it looks like right here. 
The camera, can you see? Yeah. Mm. Give me a little chocolatey. <laughs> Healthy chocolate fudge. Mm. I hope you like this recipe and you make it, you know? Let us know. Yes. If you like it, you can send us a message, a message to kymay.com or topmeals.com and you can find the recipes there as well. I'll be right back.